Hello everyone, Nico and me here, and today I'm reacting to We Bear Bears. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea what We Bear Bears is, like, at all before this. I might have seen a meme of them on top of each other once. I don't know. I'm just saying that I have no idea what We Bear Bears is, except for this three vid these three videos that I was blessed to see. So, Nintendo... I was on my phone casually on Twitter and I got a notification that three new videos were on Nintendo's YouTube channel of We Bear Bears Bear Tips for Splatoon 2. There's also one for ARMS, but I'm just focusing on the Splatoon one for this video. Uh, if I find the ARMS ones funny, I'll do that one too after this. But I learned a lot about these th three bears. There's like a grizzly bear, a regular bear, a panda bear, like a polar bear. I don't even know, but here are my favorite parts. So I'm going to play all three of the trailers. I'm going to give you my favorite parts of each of the bear tip video, okay? You'll find it funny, I promise. Hey, 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 what up? Yeah. Time to team up and battle for turf, brothers. Go! Grizz, don't fall for his tricks! Behind you! I got this! I got this! Go! Got him! Thanks, little bro! Oh, Get pumped for a fresh sequel, bros! Splatoon 2! Those squid-like inklings are back, and this time you can play on the go with Nintendo Switch! Double down in turf war battles with new dual-wielding Splat Duelies. I spare proof, by the way, he made that point very clear. And dominate the competition with all new powerful specials. Panda loves a good special. Splatoon 2, available now on Nintendo Switch. Game rated everyone 10 and up. And don't miss out on episodes of We Bear Bears on your Cartoon Network. Okay, so this is one of the more general ones where it just explain like, oh, Nintendo Switch, was it just me? Or compared to this video, compared to the videos you're gonna see later in this video, and if you ever watched Wee Bear Bears before, like when they were at like the park or like the roller rink place, like it literally sounded like they were like talking outside of a like a, a washing machine or something, or like a like a siren, like Whoa. Like it sounded so like low quality compared to the high quality of everything else when the bears were talking. It sounded so strange strange to me. Also, Panda loves a good special. Like, okay, hey Panda, I don't know who Panda is, but apparently he loves a good special. Also, are those bear shoes? I was like, what, what does that even mean? Like, oh, he's wearing bear shoes. Like, I didn't see a bear. Like, it didn't mean bear is and he's not wearing shoes, but I'm pretty sure he was quite obviously wearing shoes. So I don't really know where the bear pun was. I like this one especially, this trailer or this bear tip, because it really, really, really was pun heavy. And the other ones were just plain out like, what? What does that even mean? Or like, okay, like, whatever. Uh, this, this one in particular was very, very pun heavy. Um, it, it didn't even sound like the real characters when they were talking. Like, when you, you'll see clips of, like, the bears talking, like, in the We Bear Bears TV show, and it'll sound really high quality and, like, the real actors, but, like, when they were in the skate park, it sounded like completely different people, or, like, they were, like, compared to, like, a studio to, like, the alley. Like, I don't know where they videotaped or, uh, like, did the, the sound recording of this, but... The voiceovers were not it, um, but it was still funny. Okay, next is the Splatoon 2 Turf War trailer bear tip thing. Here you go. Nintendo Switch Bear Tips, Splatoon 2. One, two, three, game, game time. time. Yeah. Get hyped for Splatoon 2. Ah, yes, the squid-like inklings return in a colorful and chaotic 4x4 action shooter game about splatting ink and claiming turf. Splatoon 2 takes place two years after the events of Splatoon. So, you get some sick new threads, gear, and weaponry. And this time, you can take turf war battles on the go with Nintendo Switch. It's beautiful! In this main game mode called Turf War, two teams of four squid-like inklings spray the ground with ink trying to cover as much turf as possible. When time runs out, whoever's covered the most ground wins the match. Chris, don't fall for his tricks! Behind you! I got this! I got this! Go! Oh, got him! Splat Duelies are a new weapon, which let you spray ink from both hands. This is gonna be amazing! One of the coolest things about the Splat Duelies is that it gives you a new maneuver called a dodge roll. Use the jump button while you're spraying ink and roll to the left and right. This new move can get you out of some dangerous situations. 
all the special weapons in this game are brand new. The ink jet is a jet pack. You can hover in the air and release ink explosions. It's powerful, but leaves you very vulnerable. Bear tip. Once this special expires, you return to the launch point. Be careful about how you use it. It's okay, you'll be all right. Thanks for joining us for Nintendo Switch Bear Tips. Splat on, bros, with Splatoon 2. Okay, so I really like the ooh, 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 after uh, they showed the new weaponry and clothing. Like, oh my gosh, new clothes. He sounded like he was about to have a, like a, a like a spasm or something. I didn't know what was going on. Like, he was about to die there. Like, he was ready to explode. Um, <laughs> ooh, 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 new clothes. <laughs> and uh, I really like the it's beautiful and ee, uh, and all of them holding like together. Like, I didn't really understand. I really like they were they were holding like the switch and they were playing like the switch together and um it was just a really nice like generic you know like here's this Splatoon 2 turf wars and I liked at the end where it's like splat on bros like it just made no sense whatsoever this whole collaboration is just so like out of nowhere but you have to think about it in this way it's very good marketing because who are gonna really love these squid kids um kids uh kids who are watching Cartoon Network who love this show we bear bears are gonna absolutely dig Splatoon 2 you know it's just rushing for Santa's wish list now um so yeah it is a very thoughtful, smart marketing move for Nintendo, and it is a fun collaboration. Just some of the th some of the things just are so random, and it's just like these little mini clips of like the Wee Bear Bear show is just out of nowhere in the middle of this Splatoon gameplay, and it's so just like I found it funny. Like I I have no idea what these Wee Bear Bear things. I didn't get any of the references. I didn't get any of the inside jokes, but I sure did get a good laugh out of like the randomness of like the ooh ooh ees and like them holding together playing Nintendo Switch. The next and final one is when they talk about salmon run so here you go nintendo switch bear tips splatoon 2 <laughs> game time splatoon 2 features a brand new co-op mode called salmon run where four players team up to defeat waves of enemy salmonids essentially freaky mutant salmon dudes the objective survive waves of enemy salmonid attacks and harvest golden eggs Bear tip. Boss salmonids carry valuable golden eggs which must be collected and deposited. To win, defeat all salmon in a wave and carry enough golden eggs to the basket. Yeah, you guys are on fire! Salmon Run takes place in remote locations separated from Inkopolis. These rundown hotspots are perfect for power egg collectors. Like in Turf War, four Inklings make a team. Inklings wear special gear just for this particular task. New uniforms, yes! Ladies love a man in uniform. It's a power egg collector's job to defeat creatures of the Salmonid genus, which live to attack. The endless waves of Salmonid are actually awesome for power egg collectors, because the more you ink, the more power eggs you can collect. <laughs> if they're wounded, Inklings can deploy a life preserver to call for help. When their teammate inks their life preserver, they can be saved. Communication is key, because Inklings who work together, win together. We gotta celebrate! Thanks for joining us for Nintendo Switch Bear Tips. Now, go ink something! Splatoon 2. And I really like that uh, this one had like had no puns whatsoever. It was just very straightforward. This bear explaining uh, what Salmon Run was. I was like, okay, you know, yeah. I, it went from very punny to a little bit punny and random to just straightforward Salmon Run talk. Um, but yeah, just th this one especially, like the little bits of the show in the middle of the Salmon Run. I mean, Salmon Run is such a unique, random like thing. Like it's basically like. Call of Duty zombies, but with fish and salmon and squids. Like, it's just so random that the little bits of the show absolutely made no sense. It was so out of context. It made no sense, but it was still funny, and it still drove the whole collaboration, which I liked. And at the end of the video, where it was like, now go ink something. I was like, okay, buddy, let's go ink something. You know, I was feeling pretty encouraged. Overall, these videos, like, I saw them on my, like, notification. I was like, what is this Wee Bear Bears thing? But after I seen it, like, it was pretty funny, and I enjoyed it. So, Thanks, Nintendo, for making um, a collaboration of this sort. I think it was a great um, marketing move, and I appreciate it. There's also some for ARMS. If I find those funny, I'll do a video of that. But, uh, yeah, subscribe for more Nintendo news and random videos like this. I guess go watch We Bear Bears in the Splatoon 2. Coming for you. Now go splat something.